We will continue using the Power of Spirulina in our recipe today, and it's the perfect color for St. Patrick's Day celebrations. Stay tuned. Hi, my name is Katrina. Welcome to the Organics channel, where we are committed to bringing you healthy supplements, healthy recipes to support you in living your healthiest life. Today, we're going to be making spirulina chia pudding. Let's begin by adding one cup of your favorite nut, oat, or hemp milk to your blender. Next, I have three large, nutrient-rich pitted dates, which are going to act as our sweetener. Now, if your dates are a little bit hard, just simply add them to your blender and let them soak in the milk for a few minutes before you blend them, and that will really help them blend up nicely. Next, we have our power ingredient. I have one half to one teaspoon of powdered spirulina. Spirulina is a blue-green algae that is rich in antioxidants, it's also an anti-inflammatory, and it also supports a healthy liver. So it has a really strong flavor. I recommend starting off first with one half of a teaspoon and adding more after you taste it if desired. One half of a teaspoon of Ceylon cinnamon, which is also an anti-inflammatory, Last, I have one quarter to one half of a teaspoon of either almond extract or vanilla extract, and this is just to add in some flavor. Blend up your ingredients until well blended. Pour out your mixture and then add in one third of a cup of chia seeds, which are a great source of sustained energy, helping to stabilize blood sugar levels. Whisk together and then cover and refrigerate until your pudding sets, anywhere from three hours to overnight. My chia pudding has set. I can't wait to give it a taste. I topped mine with a little bit of full fat coconut cream and a little bit of Ceylon cinnamon on top. The toppings though are endless. So do whatever sounds good to you. You could use some fresh fruit, some dried fruit, chopped nuts, seeds, cacao nibs, shredded coconut, granola, really the list goes on and on. So let's give this a taste, I can't wait. Mmm, that is delicious. It's nice and sweetened with the dates. I love the addition of that coconut cream. It just evens things out for me, plus it's a really healthy fat, but you cannot go wrong. I hope you give this one a try. Thanks for being with me today. Hey, I hope you are happy, healthy, and taking amazing care of yourself. I look forward to seeing you next week in the kitchen. Bye-bye.